chair dance, Octavia Spencer. We are here with the remarkable <laughs> Oscar winner. Oh, her latest movie, A Kid Like Jake, deals with parenting a child with gender differences and the challenges the adults who love him face. Octavia plays the director of Jake's preschool, tasked with telling his parents about some concerns and that his placement in kindergarten may be in jeopardy. Take a look. I'm very sorry that this isn't the news we were hoping for, but you have to understand the number of spots we're talking about. Of course, and, and, and I know how many kids you have to place. Oh, I'm not sure what you're implying here, but you know that I care very deeply about Jake, which is why I'm doing everything in my power to place him somewhere where he feels safe and comfortable enough to... To dress like a girl. Hmm. Octavia Spencer, good morning, good morning. Good morning. Hi, First of all, you look beautiful and so rested. Do you. Oh, do you. We are still impressed <laughs> by your dance moves. I can't quite get that out of my head. Thank I know. you. Oh, I've exactly. been working on them. We had this whole idea, actually. I said they should bring back American Bandstand, and then Octavia and Hoda decided they should host we it should together. We should host it together. Which I think... Come we on, should. we could start a revolution. We both think we can dance. I, Better. <laughs> Don't we all think we can dance? I, yeah, and I kind of know that I can't. I've seen it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about this film, which is a, it's, it's very modern. It's very forward thinking. Did, when you picked up that script, did you say, yeah, this, it's time for this one? Absolutely, because I, I, you know, even though I'm not a parent, I realize there are a lot of parents who are facing this uh, um, in their household. And uh, it's just a way to uh, open dialogue. Dialogue, yeah. uh, so that children can be in an environment where they can blossom. Bring us into the story because it, it's a it's a little boy who may or may not be transgender. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's that moment in his life where his parents really aren't sure. Yes. And then they're trying to get him into kindergarten in New York City, which we all know is like you know crazy and competitive. And yes, exactly. So what? How, pick up the story from there. What what is it about? Well, I play uh, the educator who sort of. Uh, enlightens the parents that their their child is is different mm -hmm. and I use that as a positive to say this is what you could put on applications because everyone's looking for diversity and neither of the parents recognize any you know behavior that they thought was different mm -hmm. so it was illuminating to them in a way and the film really you know uh, looks at their marriage and how they deal with that news. Uh -huh. uh, we were also, on another note, watching you as you were watching the Billboard Music Awards, the, the piece that we had, and it was a lot about woman power, mm -hmm. and your eyes lit up, and you looked like you were nodding your head, mm -hmm. and I was just thinking about you, and how it was interesting, we were reading about how you and Jessica Chastain kind of teamed up to make sure that pay was on the right scale for you. Mm -hmm. Talk a little bit about what you've been going through on that front. Well, it's funny because Jessica had had this idea a couple, few years ago, and she kept telling me, I want us to do this. And she has always been at the forefront of the movement about pay parity. And I talked to her and I said, well, Jessica, I'm glad that we're having this conversation, but we have to have a deeper conversation. And then I told her what it was like for women of color. And she was quiet. What and as a friend, I said, you know, I understand that white women want to make what white men make, but women of color don't even make what you make. And she really, it, it, it was very shocked. And as a friend, you want your friend to say, I'm with you. But as a producer, she really did more than what I've known. What did she Many, do? She, uh, we, we pitched a project that she came up with uh, to several studios and everybody wanted it. And uh, a part of the bargaining was that we would be paid as equals. And um, we were having that national conversation and I thought, I need to introduce this into the narrative so that we know the way forward. And so I am a beneficiary of just Jessica uh, doing the right thing. Well, she's she's the beneficiary of you yeah. illuminating yeah. her. You two yeah. stood together, and is the movie going to get made? It, we're doing it this uh, winter. Of course you are. So. Of course you are. <laughs> we can, uh, Octavia, thank you so much for thank joining you. Thank us. Thank you. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there, and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.